things of president mm -hmm. be a president of facts of criminals who beat up people when you are done with nigerians mm -hmm. when you are done with mozambicans and zimbabweans mm -hmm. and zambians you are going to go for shangans mm -hmm. from guiani i have to stop you now before you come to me now some of us can't even talk your language they are going to ask us to pro make certain pronouncements in their language and we can't pronounce uh -huh. <laughs> wow. back to Limpopo <laughs> we are going to be victims mm -hmm. celebrate and be happy mm -hmm. and say the nonsense you are saying about na foreigners mm -hmm. and Nigerians go on when they are done they are coming for you <laughs> they are going to say no the reason we don't have jobs here is because of these Zulus yeah. Mm. They must go back to Natan. Mm. We don't have jobs here. It's this process. They must go back to Eastern Cape. Mm. They, they, we don't have jobs here. It is this ADC. Mm. It is this vendors. Mm. Back. Because there will be no foreigner to fight. Mm. But poverty will remain. Yes. Yeah. Hunger will remain. The inequality will remain. I said the other time bring all the buses let's put all these nigerians and zimbabweans in buses let's take them back and let's see if you'll get an employment tomorrow yeah. it's a myth it's the most stupid thing to think of you are justifying crime and you give it nice names called xenophobia mm -hmm. afrophobia mm -hmm. it's crime it must be dealt with as such I'm not going to join anyone who beats up an African person. I'm not part of that mess. I will never even support anyone who has to stone a white person. It doesn't matter the amount of disagreements we have with them. To come with a stone like this and put on the head of a person is unjustifiable. Not even a white person who has committed genocide here, not even declared, deserve to be stoned.